When you use a paintbrush, how you hold it and the direction you travel makes a big difference. You can make thin lines, thick lines, or super messy lines depending on where your hand is and where your brush goes. If I want to make thin lines with my paintbrush, one thing I want to make sure I'm doing is holding it on the grip and instead of holding my brush sideways, I want to be holding my brush very vertically. Imagine your brush is a ballerina and your brush is dancing on his tippy toes, barely putting any pressure on the brush. If I want to make thicker bold lines, what I would do is I would take my brush, I would push down really hard, and then my brush fans out a little bit, and I start to get thicker, darker lines. Sometimes the paint runs out before my line is done, and I might need to go back and retrace it to smooth it out. If I am not having my brush follow behind my hand, I notice sometimes people push like a shovel. You can see the brush gets really confused. He doesn't know where to go. And sometimes the hair of your brush goes all over the place and he starts to have a bad hair day. If you want to be in control of your brush today, it's really important that your brush travels behind your hand and you go slow and steady to get that really nice line. If you'd like today, you can use a smaller brush for your details. If you are using a smaller brush, you still wanna make sure you are controlling how much paint you put on the brush. Then you still want to practice good painting habits by having your hand on the grip and having your brush nice and straight so you can make those small detail lines. Remember, the harder you push, the thicker or bolder your line will be today.